Hi guys, this is Joe popping on and today I got another fun video for you. Uh, today these ones just, this guy just came out. I was really excited to go and see if I could get them and I was happy to see that I was. And today the one I was happy to get was the new Super Saiyan God um, Blue, um, however you want to say it, Goku. I don't understand why they don't just put Super Saiyan Blue um, because that's technically what they call it in the show. But I really like this one. This one's really fun. Um, yes, it's another Goku. Goku is my favorite, so I'm never really too upset to get another Goku. But there are a lot of him. Um, and uh, this one's just really fun. This one's, um, I would think, for like halfway through the Tournament of Power. Like, he's lost like half of his shirt. <laughs> but it's really cool. Here, you guys, take a look. Really nicely done. I like the fighting pose. Looks really good. I love that they have his hands correct. Because he always does that like knuckle, like hands hold. It's it's just really cool. I like it. It's really true to the show. It's really nice. Um, and once again, this one's from Hot Topic. Um, I like it's when they're from there because like you can usually you, you know what day they're coming out, and they usually have enough in stock that you can get it on the first day. So this one's really nice. I really like it, and um, I am ready to open him up. So once again, I like to use a knife. Uh, open them up nicely so you just pop it in lift slightly get it open and it's nice and easy and you get no crease no mark here it's just nicely opened because um, I like to take them out of the box but I do like to keep the box nice so let's pop this down here looks really good I like the little clamshell they have for him he sits in it well doesn't look like he'd fall forward Oh, this one's just really good. Nice battle damage on him. Like, take a look. It looks like he's going to stand well, too, which I have a complaint with a couple of the Gokus. Um, especially the last one they made for his common. Uh, he is very prone to falling over um, if you take him out of the box. But he, this one looks great. I even I really like the little the hair thing they do at the front. They haven't really done that before. Uh, oh, they, they did it for the baseball one, actually. But um, it looks really good. It's really nice. Oh, such good battle damage. Like you get it on the knee. Uh, you got a cut on the pants back here. If you guys can see that. Just really good quality. Really good like attention to detail. And I really like it. And one thing I really like is that they are really um, doing this whole tournament of power. You're pretty much getting like... like moment for moment shots from the show which is really great i really like that i like kind of like the progression of the character here i'm gonna lower this down all right here we go these is the progression of goku that they have in like the pop form so here we have him at the beginning of the tournament of power uh full orange outfit working uh, this one is now the in between half of his shirt has been ripped and then we have him when he goes into ultimate instinct when he's completely going all out with Jiren when his shirt is completely gone. I really like this. I like the progression. Um, <coughs> you can tell which ones were the earlier ones to which ones were the a uh, little bit later. Because as uh, you can tell, like he's um, one of their older figures. Um, stance is very... It's great. I love it. But um, it's not really much to it. It's very much the superhero pose. Um, and then we got over here, we got... Um, the Ultimate Instinct, which I really like the Ultimate Instinct one. Uh, I, I like the coloring. I love how they do these eyes that are different. But then we have over here, we have um, the newest one, which is the in-between, which is my favorite so far because they have the, the stance and everything like that. And um, it's just really well done. A lot of the battle damage, which I really like, also carries over very well to this one. Um, I really like it. I'm really happy that the show has done very well. It was very well received. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, they've almost dubbed the entire thing, which I'm a very big fan of the dubs. I know a lot of people only do sub, but for somebody who has dyslexia, um, I have to say I really like dubs. Um, I have a subscription to Funimation, and I really prefer them um, because for somebody who has a little difficulty reading, um, the speed of the subtitles is ever so slightly faster than I read which is really annoying and you there's no way to like slow down a TV show so the thing is it's like I'll have to skip if I do watch a um, a subtitle one 
I would usually have to skip reading the first part of the sentence or the end of the sentence for my reading speed. And you miss stuff all the time. And I just really dislike it or you're watching it and you're pausing it to read the whole thing. I know this is not everybody's problem. It is mine. And so I have to say I really prefer, I know a lot of people are like, no, the truest form is the subtitles with Japanese language. Yes, it is. But for me, um, it's not how I enjoy them. Um, I would really, uh, I'm an artist. I really like the art of animation. I really do. And if you're sitting there and concentrating all the time on the subtitles at the bottom of the screen, uh, you miss so much of the beautiful animation that is really what is supposed to have your focus. Because when they make this, you're supposed to be able to understand Japanese. <laughs> and uh, I don't. I wish I did. Um, but to make a long story short, I am so happy. It's almost completely dubbed. Um, and they're doing a couple other shows that I'm, I'm so happy that are getting dubbed now. Um, for me, I, if I have the option of watching a subtitled anime or really watching or reading the manga, nine out of ten times, I just read the manga. If I have to sit there and pause it and read it, um, I just like to read it. Um, but with these guys, like, th this show is just so good. If you guys haven't checked out the dub, I think most, uh, at least a lot of people I know, like the dub because that's what we all grew up with. Um, I watched the show on um, on um, Cartoon Network every day after school, and I just enjoyed it so much. And uh, that's what I wish they would come back with for like so many kids. Like you could come home and watch cartoons. This it's just pretty much gone. Um, Toonami, like halfway through my growing up disappeared it went to like midnight once a week i'm like how is that fun to watch anime like just think like if they put naruto and one piece and stuff and you can watch it every day one episode that's what I, I i would love um watch that watch super um it's so much fun uh but these guys are so great what do you guys think what do you like um i'm always up for hearing people's um opinions but uh, <coughs> for me I just love anime, but I really, really do like it when it's dubbed. Um, here we go. Let me lift this up. All right. So, guys, this was my my new pickup. The new Super Saiyan God Blue. I'm not sure how they do it, but I, I think it's Super Saiyan Blue Goku. I love it. It's so nice. Uh, it's just a really nice figure. Stands really well. Is in a great pose. Uh, <coughs> really... Um, I know like there are a lot of Gokus out here, but this is really well done. I really like it. Um, I think it's actually one of his best ones. Um, and I highly recommend it. I just think it's so nice. Um, I'm kind of glad that it's not with the shiny blue hair, the metallic hair, because I do like the pops without it. The The metallic is fun on a couple, but once again, I, I, I do prefer the, the not, uh, sh not shiny, <laughs> not metallic. Um, but this one's just really nice. Great battle damage, great figure. So let me know what you guys think. Um, I'm really also looking forward to Vegeta crushing the Scouter. Um, I think that one comes out next month. Um, but this one is a really nice one. And uh, <laughs> I have nothing but good things to say about it. If you guys can get your hands on it, definitely grab it. Um, I know it's going online tonight. So if anybody who missed out on it in stores, hop on it tonight. Um, I know it's going to go up. I'll go see if I can put the link into the description. Um, but really grab this one for any DBZ fans. Um, like it's just so good. Um, such a nice figure and I'm just so glad they're doing more Dragon Ball Z. Hopefully we get some more characters, more so different scenes and stuff like that. But this one is really good. Um, I just think the, the whole, the whole look of it, I really like the hands. Um, because usually they don't have really anything to do with the hands, but this one's really nice. So thank you all for tuning in. Once again, if you liked what you saw, um, please uh, hit that like button. It really does help. And also, if um, if you have anything to, like you would like to see, anything you'd like, um, let me know. Leave a comment down below. I'd love to hear it. Um, once again, the channel's just getting started. We're getting a nice little start. Um, but I'd like to hear what you guys would like to see, what you guys like would like. Um, and thank you guys so much. And if you guys like what you're seeing, please hit subscribe. It really helps. And um, there goes one of them. <laughs> and um, it really helps. Thank you so much, everybody. Uh, this is Joe popping on. And I'm popping off. Thank you, guys. Doodles.